So the next thing I'm going to show you is how you can connect your name.com hosting to WordPress. What you're going to do is when you're on your hosting package, and if you forgot how to get there, you'll go to my products and then click on the hosting. And once you're on this page, you will go ahead and click over here to log into your cPanel and it automatically logs you in. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna scroll down all the way to the bottom. And what you're gonna click here is WordPress. And if you already have, have any WordPresses installed, you might see them down here. But if you're just starting off, you'll wanna click install and it comes up here and it will tell you choose installation URL and it automatically adds all of your domains that you have in your name.com hosting. So today I'm gonna install it on this one. And then it gives you some options to customize. So um, maybe I wanna title it Samantha's page, leave my WordPress blog. It will give you a username and then it gives you a password, which is really a bad password. So you should replace that to something um, secure and that you'll remember. Um, and then the admin email, it will automatically fill in as admin at your domain.com. If you want to customize that, you can. Um, it helps that if you need to reset your password, you can do that with your email. But if you um, have it installed through cPanel, you can also reset your password back this way. If you keep scrolling, you don't need to worry about any of this. And it'll tell you, here are all the themes. You can choose one if you want or if you don't select anything, they'll install the default theme. And then you just click install. And then it goes like this. And it says it may take three to four minutes, but it's normally faster than that. Once that's done, you can go ahead and click this button. And here it is, here's your WordPress page. So you'll see it here. And it says, hello world, welcome to your WordPress page. There that is. And then if you need to get in an edit or anything, you can go back to that WordPress page, scroll down here, and it will have all of your WordPresses. And you can click on this person here, and it will automatically log you into your WordPress admin, so you don't even need to go to forward slash WP admin. It will automatically um, log you in, and you can do all of your stuff. You can add plugins, um, the appearance, anything you need to do on your site, you can do from there.